Hello, brothers and sisters. I'm like, no, welcome, welcome, welcome to my page. My page is about common sense. I try to get to down to the nitty gritty, okay, and use common sense like Mark Twain and Socrates by using uh, constructive questioning. And of course, no one really challenges me correctly because nobody really have an inquisitive mind these days. But of course, most people are idiots, and you should know that. Common sense. <laughs> that should be my damn intro. You know, that should be my intro. Hmm, I might think about changing it. But, anyway, if you have any comments, questions, or even insults, you put it down below. And, of course, I'll view it and screen it. And I'll approve of it. Okay. If it's a repeating insult and you have no videos, you will not see your insult there. Okay. I know there's a lot of racism out there, and racism still do exist. But let's get on with the video. <laughs> now, okay. My videos have a comical approach, use common sense, and narrows it down to the simplicity of the core, the gist of all. Okay. Now, this video is going to be about Facebook pages, Facebook pages and sensitive folks. Because um, just a little while ago, I learned something very quickly. Okay? If you make a Facebook page, you better close it. Okay? You don't necessarily have to make it secret, okay? but don't make it public. I, I, I'm going to tell you a little hint, okay? You know, I'm going to do the little line I usually do, as some people say they like when I do it. The more wider you go, the more jealous and the more sensitive the motherfuckers are, okay? Now, I'm not hating. I'm just trying to tell you how it is, because back in history and time, you know, the Southern, that motherfucker looked like a nigger. And so, we're going to rape his daughter, okay? We're not talking about that here, okay? Is this a genetic trait, okay? Blacks, whites, whites are the jealous, okay, and the more insensitive, okay. So if you have a page, okay, blacks, however, they don't have no time to be tagging up your motherfucking page because they don't have the intelligence or either they don't have the interest to even click on your and report your page unless they're foreigners, unless he's, you know, has a couple foreign black motherfuckers hit up my Facebook a few times and I got blocked for that shit for a day. Okay, unless they're foreign, okay. Because my demographicals are what people see me as usually Far East and in the United States and a little bit in Canada. Hallelujah. These are statistical stereotypicals. Algorithmic research, okay? All right? So if you have a page, let's say you create a page. Okay, now I got like three to four pages on my main page, right? Okay? And you start seeing white people, white people, white people coming to your page, okay? You better watch out for a spy. Have you ever played the game called Risk? <laughs> Have you ever played the game called Stratego okay, or Chess? Okay, you gotta watch the motherfuckers because they'll report your shit and it could be something totally not breaking the policy. And they'll try Facebook. I have gotten some of my picture. I put a picture up or something. It would had nothing to do with nudity or or anything violent or anything like that. And then I'm getting a message. This has happened to me twice now that you put something sensitive up there. Okay. Or they'll try to, Facebook will say, you know, the, the Jewish people or the, the mixed Caucasoid races, they will basically say, we have a right to put, take down anything that's sensitive to people. If a certain amount of people, okay, particularly white, okay, um, or you can even be black, because I'm not trying to be racist here, would say something, then it's, it most likely should not be pulled down if it's a simple picture of the color purple. Okay? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You'll put something up there and you're trying to make a point. And then you, and then Facebook gets back to you and says, "Oh, we are uh, blocking your page for seventy-two hours." Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna call this video the seventy-two hour block. Okay, all about it. Okay, but of course, uh, you, I'm pretty sure intelligent individuals only have this kind of problem. I'm an explicit individual okay, who speaks about the truth and knowledge, and white people don't like that shit. Okay, okay. Now you may have some Negroes, some house Negroes who would just probably. Click your page and they don't like it, but that's not enough because they might not listen to that nigga. Facebook might, if Facebook is white, okay? <laughs> Facebook. Facebook. Come on now. As uncreative as that name is, okay? Mike Zuckerberg. Come on now. Okay. We could change the name to something else, okay? Um, but anyhow, it doesn't matter. I love Mike and Zuckerberg because I can post my face on Facebook and please do not block my Facebook ever again. <laughs> But I have been blocked twice. One time for saying something small. Somebody said something to me and I said something back. They didn't like it. 
So they blocked me. I don't know if the other person got blocked or not. And uh, and then I, but the second time, I put a picture up there. It wasn't nothing violent. It was about the Georgia Stones. Okay? It was like, this picture is sensitive. And sensitive. I'm like, dude, okay, are you serious? Okay? This world is still controlled by the white caucasoids. And as long as it's controlled by a person who is a hierarchy gene pool, okay, there will always be sensitivities and there will always be jealousies. I said, why not? I even asked Facebook. I said, why don't you separate those apples from oranges by saying, okay, hit this person explicit. So you can't report an explicit person if they put something sensitive there. As long as it's not terroristic, as long as it's not pornography, everything goes. As long as it's not something that's completely bloody, because I've seen some videos on Facebook, and I'm like, how the hell did this get up on there? Lasted for days. But as soon as I put a, a picture of a motherfucker Georgia Stonehenge, or as soon as I respond back to someone who insulted me first, I get blocked for seven, a day to the three to 72 hours. Okay? <laughs> now understand, this is facts, okay? So if you get you create pages for yourself, you're going to have to make sure it's closed or... Or secret if you're that paranoid, okay? But you shouldn't put public pages. I just learned my lesson. I got a couple crackers I got to delete off the pages and shit like that. And, and I'm not hating on white folks, okay? Because you need white folks for uh, secrets and shit, you know, manipulations and shit, you know. And you need black folks for rhythm and blues, okay? <laughs> Everybody got their own traits. You need the Chinese for anime, okay? <laughs> and the Kama Sutra, okay? And, yeah, and you need the Indians to smoke the weed, okay? Right? You know, see, everybody has their own attributes, okay? And these, those are facts, okay? Stereotypical facts, okay? But that's all I wanted to say, okay? Let me see, what else is there to say about um the 72-hour block on Facebook, which I will call this video. I don't really like, I like the fact, I wish Facebook would basically listen to the people, the people who are more intelligent versus the ones who's just using the Facebook for Jesus fanatics, you know, Jesus bumpers, you know what I'm saying? Because I'm tired of seeing people saying, hey, man, you don't. Click on this page and you'll be cursed or some shit like that. Okay, I got less than a minute. And of course, I hate that, okay? Because those are, are the many, okay? 80% of the world's population is religious. That's sad. Peace and love to you, brothers. This is of light and dark. I'm running out of time. I better click off this right now. And remember my, what I say. Watch the whiteies, okay? Not the darkies, okay? <laughs> Did that sound racist? No, it's not, okay? Peace. Get a life.